Hey guys, my name is Kai Hendry. I'm an infrastructure lead at ThoughtWorks. Last year, I published a video about a path to production using GitLab. And here I was using Git tags to, to sort of promote between um, environments. And I think it was lacking some context here. Like I think it was very strict in this particular client. And I thought it's high time to update this using GitHub Actions instead of GitLab to prove a point about how to do CI CD correctly. And the right way is something like this. I have a blog about it. The right way is to deploy to dev from your main immediately. Run some tests, some typically some integration tests to make sure that dev is behaving as expected. And then if that is working, then you promote to staging immediately. And similarly, ideally, doesn't quite happen that way in reality, you promote to production once your staging tests pass. There's your pipe. Go to dev, do, do the test. If the test fails, you don't go to uh, staging. And then I deploy to staging here. No, nothing's changed, so nothing really happened. Uh, of course, this would is just to staging, it would be a bit longer going to production. And you, like many, would probably um, perhaps require some approval. And you can just do that with GitHub quite easily. You, you know, you've, you, can, you can set up your environments to, to require reviewers. So that is how to do it right, in my opinion. Be great to get your comments below. The source code is here. So you can use this as a template to get going. Um, Usually I would have to rewrite this from scratch every time I was a new client, but now I have a, a template that I can use too. And, um, and this particular directory has this sort of awkward um, um, sort of OIDC setup, so you don't have to use keys. You just use like the repo name as the way to allow you to access your cloud environment. Um, so you, there's a bit of boot, bootstrappity stuff happening in there. But once you got going, then you um, essentially use a prefix on your back end to distinguish between your environments. And I would even go so far to allow developers to, to develop on dev. So do, to accommodate local development, you know, it's all about speed, really. So I allow uh, developers to, 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 uh, to plan and maybe even apply on dev. Of course, not on staging and definitely not on production, but you get the point. So I hope you guys will enjoy this, adapt it, give me some feedback. Um, maybe I, I could consider workspaces instead. If you guys use workspaces, comments below. I think this is a great way to do CICD right. Comments below. Please give the video a like. Thank you for watching. Bye.